Hi guys, welcome to Android Galaxy development. Today I'm going to show how to install Linux Evolution version 2 on Samsung Galaxy Y GTS 5360. First of all, download all the files in the gi uh, given in the description and your uh, device should be charged minimum 80%. Place the files outside uh, the SD card, it means do not include it in any folder so that it will be easy to flash. So let's go through the procedure. First of all, power off your device. Linux Evolution version 2 is an is an custom ROM which is uh, based on the stock based. So we will flash it and I'll be showing its review too. First of all, now you have to go to the recovery mode for that you have to press your power button, volume up button and home button simultaneously that means together. As the Samsung Galaxy Y logo blinks, we can leave the buttons. And now you will be uh, booting up into the recovery mode. This is Android system recovery mode. Here the touch is disabled and you have to scroll up and down with your volume up and volume down button. You can come back using the power button and selection by the home button. So first of all, now we are going to do is uh, apply update from SD card, the second option. Select the CWM, you can use any CWM. The links are also been published in the description. Select the CWM. Now here you are in the clockwork recovery mode and here also the situation is same. The touch is disabled. You have to scroll up and down with your volume up and volume down button. And you can come back by using the power button and home button by uh, for selections. Now select the third option which is wipe data factory reset and select yes. It's wiping data and then you have to select wipe cache partition select yes and now you have to go to the second last option which is mount and storage select mount and storage and you have to mount the first four wherever you see mount the word mount you have to just click go on clicking on that so mount data first then mount SD card and system and cache is already mounted over here if it is not mounted in your device please do mount it the first four should be mounted. Now come back. Now it's the last uh, last step. Select the uh, install zip from SD card option and select the first option, choose zip from SD card. Now locate your uh, ROM package, which is a Linux evolution version two signed dot zip. Select that and select yes to install the Linux evolution. Now it's a, uh, it's on the flashing procedure and now uh, look at this it's uh, showing that installing the room and the installation may take a little while please uh, do not panic it's installing it may take a little while Yeah, it's showing done and some more installation like busy box and everything and here you can see uh, it has been shown install from SD card is completed now you can come back by using your power button and select the first option reboot system now it's booting it may take a little while to boot because it's the first boot it's uh, I'll show its boot animation it's quite good look at this this is the boot animation it's booting it's quite good room I'll be showing its uh, review too here it is it has been booted and now it will take a little while to come into the page into the main page the installation procedure is quite simple not much confusing there we go it's coming into the main page after it gets vibrate it means it is going to be loading the first page so the, it, ta it takes time for the only the first time it has been vibrated once it means it is going to load the first page now it's coming to the main page now here it is 
you are on the uh, you are on the Linux evolution now. You just uh, change the language one so that it will not make a problem further. Select United States or your own language, whichever it is. Select on the pop, and it's like the stock stock room, but it has got a very uh, good features. I'll show you the features which are available in this custom room. Yeah, here it is. You're in the you're in the evolution room. As you can see, media scanning is going on, so we will wait until the media scanning has been completed. Yeah, we are back, and uh, you can see the media scanning is completed. I'll show you first the notification bar here. This is the notification bar. You may be thinking there's nothing. You just slide this side. You will be getting these many options. We have having 15 toggles over there: data, GPS, flashlight, brightness, sound, auto rotation, lock screens, reboot, shutdown, and here we have a switch and Linux parts settings shortcut direct sliders over here, which you can uh, control the system volume, the volume settings, every everything from this side, and in about you can add your own uh, your own pick over here so that it shows that the phone belongs to you. And here is, it's a, as I told before, it is a stock room based and um, there are no changes, uh, there are no changes in, uh, in the menu and the Android version. You can see this many options are there in the power, power option. And I'll show you further. It has got, it, got its own wallpaper gallery even. Linux, there are very good wallpapers. These are the wallpapers available with this ROM. Now I'll show you a setting at a glance. This is the setting, uh, which you have got three parts over here. Until here, date and time, you have got in the first one. You can control your Wi-Fi, Bluetooth. Everything is uh, working. It is being tested. And here it is. This is uh, the Linux parts development control. Tools, CPU controls, launcher settings, graphical user interface setting, lock screens. Lock screens also, we have got many types of lock screen over here. You can try it out. UI settings, which is here, you can put your owner profile as it is. You can put your owner profile. I will show it. It's Provin. Karma. Maybe we can do it. And I'll show you over here. Here is about. You can see over here, Provin Vishwakarma as it is. I'm not displaying my pick right now. You can do it. UI chooser. This will super user will ask a uh, will ask the permission for granting. And here you can you can change it classic UI. But after that, a reboot will be required. So you can do it. Status bar. You're having many tweaks, clock tweaks, battery options, battery bar, signal options, Linux label. Label in label you can put or label which you want. This is our team Galaxy Android Galaxy development. And you can just set the label. You can see oh, it has been displayed at the top. And here this is the about phone, the developers behind it. These are the developers which are, who are behind this custom room, and the Android version is not yet changed. It, but the inpick has been changed to Linux Evolution, and room name is Linux Evolution version two. That is with this. It's quite smooth. You have to try, try it out, and please let me know your experiences. If you have any problem, please do comment down. Uh, comment down into my video. All the download links have been given in the description and please like the video and please do subscribe to the channel. Thank you for watching.